My name's Peter Fitzsimons and this is my book, Victory at Villa's Britain Year, Why French Town Will Never Forget the Anzacs. If I do say so myself, it is an extraordinary yarn because we've gone through, I've done the trilogy, it started with Gallipoli, I did uh, Fromel, Pozier, the battles of Fromel and Pozier, Gallipoli we all know about Fromel, God help me, what an awful story is that, 7,000 Australian men go forward in the space of 14 hours. Five and a half thousand are gunned down, 1,900 are killed. Pozier we went for six weeks, we lost 7,000 men killed. So the story of the First World War for the Australians is bloody grim, seriously grim, right up until I get to 1918, and this time the goodies start to win. And I mean, I'm quite stunned at the achievements of the Australians. The 21st of March, the Germans come over the top, all the men have come back from the Eastern Front, and they head they head towards the channel, they're trying to get to Amiens. They get very close to Villers Breton Year. The Australians defend Villers Breton Year the night of the 4th, 5th of April, and they hold the Germans off. And then they're taken out, and the Brits are put in. And with great respect to the Brits, the Brits lose Villers Breton Year. They send for the Australians to go to get it back. And the story of that battle is stunning. Over the course of that March 21st to, I think, from 29th of April, the Australians fought all around them, this carnage, all, and with great respect to the Brits who fought courageously, but the Brits are falling back, the French are falling back, and this is not vainglorious breast beating, but the truth of it is the Australians fought 12 battles in that five or six week period. They were victorious in dot three, carry one, subtract two, 12 battles. They didn't give an inch. And it's sad in a way that Victories like Villers Breton Year are shaded by Gallipoli because we don't we focus so much on Gallipoli we don't know about the rest. In terms of Australian arms, feats of Australian arms, it does not come much better. So that's the end of my trilogy. Number one is Gallipoli, number two is the book on the battles of Fromel and Pozier. And here is the third and final victory at Villers Breton Year. I do hope, rather than enjoy it, I hope it moves you and inspires you. Thank you. And of course, all three books are available at booktopia.com.au. I love them like brothers and sisters. They are my brother from another mother. They are my sister from another mister.